Hello. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, depending on where you are in this world. Um, I am going to attempt to do a catalog walkthrough, and I'm going to attempt to do it in a little bit of a different way, because as you probably know, if you are friends with me at all, you know, on social media or in real life, or if you've been following me for any amount of time, you know that I have a tendency to try to do things different. <laughs> um, and uh, yeah, I software and hardware and computer and tech and stuff like that can sometimes evade me a little bit, but then sometimes I can figure something out that's kind of cool. So I'm going to try to do this in a little bit of a different way. I'm going to do a catalog walk with you. <clears throat> we have the new catalog and I did just get it delivered to my house about two days ago and I haven't even looked at it yet. Technically, as, Sensi, as a Sensi consultant, I have had the opportunity to look thoroughly through this catalog and I have not because I wanted to do it authentically initially for the first time with you. So. What I'm going to do is I'm going to try to do a little side-by-side -side action, okay? And you're going to see what I see, even though I'm looking at it here. The title of the catalog is Above and Beyond, and this is very pretty. This is different from uh, the way our catalogs have looked in the past, and would you look at the middle right there? Do you see that middle thing right there? That's an air purifier. An air purifier. We've never had one of those before. This is very exciting. The next page is Heidi and Orville and all of their kids and spouses and grandchildren. Um, I guess there's only one grandchild, but there's also a grand cat. Heidi and Orville are actually living in um, Britain right now. I'm so jealous. Every once in a while, Heidi will post a picture on Instagram of like the view from her London apartment, and it's like, ugh. They are taking three years away from the company to go and work with their ministry. So to each their own, they have been working towards this particular mission for a very long time. This doesn't sound like something that I would ever do, but I have a lot of admiration for people who are willing to walk away from a multi-million dollar, billion dollar, not exactly sure, company in order to live out their dreams in other aspects of their life. Awesome, cool. This is one of my favorite charitable cause warmers that we've had in a long time. Um, it's called Hope Blooms, it's 50 bucks, and uh, $9.50 goes towards a, the Sensi Family Foundation, which gives to a lot of different, they used to have one particular charity that they chose once a year, and now they, they have the Sensi Family Foundation, which um, divvies that out into different charitable organizations, and trust me, well, I mean, don't trust me, whatever. This is a beautiful warmer, it's worth $50, but then just know that $9.50 of your money is going to go where Sensi feels that that money needs to go. Whiff box, you guys know that I've always been touting the whiff box. It's $30, you get at least $35 worth of stuff. I mean, it comes to you once a month if you want it once a month, but then you can get it like once every other month, every three months, you can only order it once in a while if you want to. You can put it into your Sensi Club so that it comes automatically and you don't have to worry about it. Um, a lot of times it comes with like a little insert with little activities for kids and stuff like that. So the Whiff Box is great. The box that it actually comes in is also really good for repurposing. It's very attractive on the outside. I'll put a little link here about how awesome Scentsy Club is. I have my own Scentsy Club. That is a video that I actually have to film because I did get my Scentsy Club delivered a couple days ago. I only get it every three months because what's in my Scentsy Club is only discontinued wax. I don't get anything else in my Scentsy Club, but I have people that put car bars, scent circles, cleanser, all kinds of things into their Scentsy Club because they just, they want it delivered when they want it delivered and that's that. And that's fine. Okay, a step above. That's really pretty. Okay, so this warmer is called Palette. It's 55 bucks. Looks like it's a dusky lavender. That's beautiful. 55 is a little pricey for a six and a half inch tall warmer. I'll be honest with you. I like the idea that it's not too bright though. It's a clear glass, well it's not clear, but it's a glass warmer, but it's not too bright. As you can see, it's right next to this other one that's 25 watts also. And you can tell that the other one is pretty bright. Um, the other one is called Mirrored Rose. Now I will tell you that I've seen pictures of this with it off and where you see those dark specks, that's actually mirror-ish. You can see the mirror aspect of it better when the warmer is off. So I was looking at pictures of it on and off and I'm like, well, I kind of like the way it looks better off. And then for $55, am I really gonna buy something that I love the way it looks when it's off <laughs> and then I'm not gonna use it. Anyway, 
Okay, page nine uh, is basically talking about the Scentsy Bars, that we have over 80 um, flavors, fragrances of wax, and this is what a Scentsy Bar looks like, cashmere and corduroy. I did smell it for the first time yesterday. You'll see that video if you haven't seen it already. If I've already posted it, I'll put a link here, whatever. But yes, I did smell all the new fragrances. So like I said, the owners of the company are very mission oriented and they're very spiritual people. And you can work with Scentsy and not be spiritual and you can work with Scentsy and have that be your driving force. It's whatever, you know, and then most of us fall somewhere in between. <laughs> Amazing Grace, it's actually very beautiful. When Scentsy does these uh, warmers that are like um, a cream colored ceramic and then it's etched with design in it, those are some of the most beautiful warmers. It's only $40, it's a 25 watt bulb. You can put colored bulbs in there. The colored bulbs are probably gonna work amazing in this one uh, because it's not too large and the heat won't get lost. Um, we go down to Love Lives Here. This one's really pretty. I was just talking about how much I loved teal the other day. Is it is it teal? It's kind of teal. It's bluish grayish slate color. Love Lives Here, that's not too spiritual. That's not too like religious, right? It's real pretty. And it looks like those leaves are mirrored. That's really interesting looking. Okay. Trust in him has, that, that's been around for a while. Um, you, do, you do you, it says. Do what makes you happy. That's nice. You know that I always do what makes me happy. <laughs> it's like when it comes to like my kids, but I kind of like that little plug-in warmer. The plug-ins are always $20 unless they're in clearance and then they're gonna be cheaper. And then unless they are a licensed product, then they might be about $5 more expensive. Like we just had the Mrs. Potts and Ship from the Beauty and the Beast. He was 25 bucks, sold out in like five minutes, you know? <laughs> uh, God is great. I sold a lot of those actually, $45, but that's a beautiful warmer, really pretty. Um, that says that Veronica from Instagram posted this Scentsy snapshot of the Trust in Him warmer. That's with it on. I wonder if that's the Veronica from my team. That would be really interesting because I think that she has that warmer. The Believe in Your Dreams is real pretty. I've seen that. I've sold a ton of those. Love Your Journey is not very glowy, okay? It doesn't give off a, a shit ton of light, okay? Dream It, Live It, Love It. I have sold so many of these plugins and for only $20 with one bar of wax is 26 bucks. That's like the best gift that you can give to somebody. Every Moment Matters. This is a little too rustic for me, but I like the fact that the the writing is there and then the light sort of comes in like it's a window or a sign. It's kind of nice. Choose Happy is always great. And again, all the minis are $20, which is nice. And then it comes with the light bulb. If you need another light bulb, you let me know. They're 15 watts. Don't try to get it at the, at the hardware store. I'll just send you one, don't worry about it. I, I was waiting for this page. Because this one on the right, flaunt your feathers. Oh my God. <laughs> If you've ever seen pictures of my living room, you know that this warmer is going to look stunning in my living room. And yes, I will buy it. Mm -hmm. There's no special right now for Scentsy Consultants, unless you like win it in an incentive, incentive prize or something like that. We all have to spend the same amount of money that you do to get this $55 warmer, unless you open up a party and you have like five or six of your friends that'll buy one warmer and a couple bars of wax. And then if that party, it's not a party, it's just a shopping link. If that shopping link gets $200 in orders, all of a sudden you've got $20 worth of free stuff and half price item. Yay. That warmer for 35 bucks, if you can open up a party and get $200 in orders, that warmer for 35 bucks is great. Or you can get it at half off, which would make it $27.50. <laughs> I don't math. Okay. Jungle Canopy. Again, here we go with the cream colored ceramic warmer that glows with the etched design so that it's pronounced. It's a pronounced design. Beautiful. That was my very first warmer. I'll put a picture of it right here. My very first warmer was called Flower Vine. It came in my Scentsy kit and I still have it to today. It's in my bedroom. I use it every single day. Love it. Dancing Petals is very pretty. You've got the teal, you've got the light, light blue, and then you've got the, the deep orange or like the burnt sienna kind of color, and then that mandarin color. Oh, I, that's very pretty. $55 is a little pricey for that, 
I think that $55 for the flaunt your feathers is a little bit more worth it. Um, I mean, they're both six and a half inches tall. Listen, I'm only saying that because the flaunt your feathers looks a little bit more elaborate to me. You get what you want. But look at this sage advice. It, again, only $20. That is gorgeous. Look at it off. Look at the difference between it off and on. When it's off, it looks like sage colored, which is probably why it's called sage advice. I've been called a sage. Yeah. I've also been called um, not a mensch. What the hell was it? It was like, um, it's in Yiddish and it's like um, maven. I've been called a maven. I don't know. I don't know what that is. Is it like the woman in charge of the house kind of a thing? Anyway, sage advice. Love that warmer. On to page 13. Succute Lent sold hundreds, not thousands. I've sold a lot of these okay not thousands this went sold out because it was the warmer of the month for april i think um went sold out but now it's going to be available in catalog uh aloe vera and little garden so these three warmers can you imagine these three warmers together on a mantle how adorable is that or if you have a greenhouse or some sort of enclosed porch beautiful Are you kidding me midnight floral i've sold a bunch of these too beautiful absolutely gorgeous okay uh, the Wings Warmer is coming back. The Lavender Love is coming back. Sold a lot of the Lavender Love. There was a full-size Lavender Love for Mother's Day. Was it Mother's Day? Yes, it was Mother's Day. Okay, page 14. Peace of Mind. Ooh. Okay. So I'm looking at this Crimson Warmer, which is $55. It's obviously on the Birchwood Cord Concealing Warmer Stand. So it's got the same kind of finish that the Moon Over Jupiter Warmer had. But for some reason, Moon Over Jupiter was not available for a really long time. So that, I like the shape of this, though. And the fact that it's like the deep rose and then light pink. Very nice. Fabulous Feathers is, a com is coming back. It's not new, okay? I, I'm not crazy about the Fabulous Feathers, only because it's a 25 watt bulb and that bulb is shining right in your face. I've seen it in person. I wasn't crazy about it. Just my opinion. Opulence. I have wanted this warmer forever and I always find, I, I put some sort of obstacle in front of myself for some reason that I don't buy it. But I love this warmer and I have to get this warmer. Eventually I will get it. Happy Henna, this actually was, did, is this a repeat from the summer collection? No, we had something Henna. Oh no, it wasn't, it was this kind of style. In the summer collection, we had a mason jar warmer, huge, enormous mason jar warmer, and it had that Henna design on the outside that's similar to this. Okay, so these are not new. The Himalayan salt in pink is not new. That sold out. They don't, they don't offer it in white anymore. I have the white one, I love it. I absolutely love it. And I have a purple bulb in it. The whole thing glows purple. It's great. Amber Glow, I do, I will put a little video of that here. Um, very, very pretty. The leaves that you see on the side, uh, you'll see it in this little video. The leaves are like come separate and they're really pretty. They're like gold. I don't know if you call it lame. It's like, it's very thin gold leaf um, accessories, like a bracelet. Okay, angel wings, I've seen people make things on their Cricut, like with vinyls, and put it on the angel wings warmer. I don't know if that's like, you know, legal or, you know, kosher to do as far as Scentsy goes, but I've seen people do it, and it's usually in memoriam of somebody that's passed away. Dreamcatcher is very nice, not very bright. It looks like a white ceramic warmer, but it doesn't glow very bright, okay, which is good. Um, and then th these three pictures on the bottom are just pictures that any Joe Schmo can put on Instagram. And if you put hashtag Scentsy Snapshot, Scentsy might put it on the website or in the catalog. And they did with these, okay? Now, page 16. These are beautiful. I haven't seen them in person, but I have seen them on a live broadcast. Um, it's the Salerno Mini and then the Salerno. And the design is very nice um it's very again it's that cream colored this is a little bit more white than cream that creamish white colored ceramic and then the glow shines through and then highlights the pattern beautiful for twenty dollars that mini warmer is beautiful in my opinion uh letterboard warmer was another warmer of the month that went sold out right away 
I have one in my stash. I'm so happy that I have one in my stash. Uh, and it does come with the letters. And then you can buy other letters too. You're not look through Scentsy, but you can go to Target and buy like these kind of letters. Um, and it does come with a little handful of like little emojis and stuff like that. And you can let the kids play with it as long as the wax isn't full and you know, hot, whatever. Light from within. Um, that's not new. I have not seen that one in person, but the light from within mini is new. And I love the way that one looks. That's really, really pretty. Um, in the clouds, it's full size, $45 uh, warmer, doting dots, milk diamond glass, sorry, diamond glass, milk glass, diamond milk glass. I'm putting words where they don't belong. I have sold so many of the diamond milk glass warmers. They're only $30. They're understated yet beautiful. It really does. It, it's like milk glass. I love milk glass, which is usually have like little bumps on it. And usually it's more like in antique shops and stuff like that. This warmer actually kicks ass and will throw a lot of scent. You just put one cube and it shows it with like three or four cubes here in the thing. You put one cube in there and it's going to scent an entire room. As long as you're not like open concept with ceiling fans and stuff like that. The Diamond Milk Glass Warmer is a great starter warmer. A lot of people, if they are just being introduced to Scentsy for the first time and they say, I don't really know what to get, get the Diamond Glass Warmer. No, Diamond Milk Glass Warmer. Just get it. Or any other plug-in. But I like this Paloma too. This Paloma is really pretty. Spot on. And then uh, the Take a Stand. The Take a Stand is so cute. And that's right up there with the Opulence Warmer. I want it and I've wanted it for a year, two years, something like that. I still haven't gotten around to getting it because again, I have so many, I have so many. Okay, page 18. Along the sea floor, this is very pretty. If you know anybody who is like, you know, a beach fan or lives at the beach or every chance that they get, they go on vacation at the beach. That's really pretty. It's got the starfish there. Um, ocean life, oh, that's really pretty. It's got the seahorse and I don't see a sand, uh, there's a sand dollar there. There's a uh, starfish. Uh, looks like there might be a little octopus there on the side. And then I see a little fishtail on the left and then a um, shell. That's really pretty. It's really nice. I love you to the beach and back. You know what? This would be really good. If you have a timeshare or if you share a house or if you rent a house for a week or if you go to like a B&B and &B, and you leave this behind, like you bring it with you on vacation, and then you leave it behind with a little note that says, here's a gift from me to you. You could even bring this to a hotel room and leave it for the maid, cleaning person. I don't wanna say maid, right? Is that like whatever, politically incorrect? You leave this with a little note that says, here's a gift from me to you, with a half a bar of wax. It doesn't even have to be new. It's a gift, you're not selling it. That is an awesome gift. Do you really know somebody who would work in a hotel that makes so much money that they would see that beautiful warmer that says, I love you to the beach and back or whichever one of these warmers and would be like, oh, I don't want that shit and throws it in the garbage. No, they would take it and they would use it and they would probably remember. They would probably appreciate it. Did you know that you get rated on, B on B Airbnb as a guest? And if you get bad ratings, they won't rent to you again? Did you know that? Anyway. Along the beach is not very beachy, but the I'll tell you, because I've seen this in person, the outside of this is very um, grippy. It's very bumpy. And it's almost like little um, glass crystals are stuck to it. That's what that looks. I, I, this is not the best picture of this warmer. If I can find a better picture, I'll put it over here. Okay. Uh, Midnight Tide is beautiful. That is like a navy blue, mirrory, and then what you actually see is the light shining through. It's almost like negative space. Does that make sense? Washed ashore is a very funny shape. And I, I, I would not put this in my house. Um, and I have not sold any of these. <laughs> I'll be honest with you. But um, listen, if you like it, you like it. Cool. Uh, tide pool. Look at, the, look at the lower picture. And then look at the one that they show in the catalog. Upper picture in the middle. That's off, and then the lower picture, is it on? So that's what, again, when we're talking about negative space, um, you're only seeing the light. So if, I see the light. So if you go through phases in the day where you have warmers on and warmers off, chances are you're not 
gonna like the way it looks off. Maybe. I don't know. Marrakesh is gorgeous. I have a soft spot in my heart. Marrakesh um, was one of the last videos that somebody named Michelle made for her YouTube channel. She was a very successful Sensi consultant. She was on my team. She was the third person to ever join my team back in 2016. And she passed away about five months ago. Five months ago, actually. It's five months ago this week, I think. Um, battled a hell of a journey with cancer. It was not very slow. It was a little quick and it was extremely painful and it was terrible. If you ever had the opportunity to say fuck cancer, you got to say fuck cancer when you talk about Michelle because cancer robbed her big time. Uh, Carolina Coast, they can, pr they can practically consider this a brand new warmer because this came out last year and then within the first week of it being out, um, they found all these problems with the warmer and blah, blah, blah. So then they went back and they redesigned the warmer. And so now it's back again. Anyway, uh, page 20, time to shine. Glimmer and Glow is not new. This was a scent of, scent of the month. This was a warmer of the month about a year ago. Um, and uh, they redesigned it so that the lid is open like that. When they first did it, the lid was closed and it didn't let off any fragrance. Hello. So now they opened it up and now it's beautiful. So those are rice lights inside. And so this is an element warmer. It's not too bright. So I actually know a couple people who bought two. They put one on each side of their mantle. Isn't that nice? Uh, but if you look down below that, the Glisten warmer is new. It's only $40, which is nice. It takes a 20 watt bulb, which I love. 20 watt bulbs are great because they're not too bright. Sometimes if it's a 20 watt bulb, you can actually have it in the room with you when you sleep. This looks like it might be a little too bright for that, but the fact that that gold is on the second, is on the lower half of the warmer, means that if you had this up high, it's not gonna throw a lot of light like right into your face all over the room, okay? Kind of like that. And look at those little feet. Those little gold feet are very cute. All right, page 21. Twinkle is not new. If you go back and you look at what? If you go back and look at Along the Beach, two pages ago, which is $50, and then Twinkle, which is $50, it's very similar, except the Along the Beach has a little bit different color, okay? Glitter Silver is the same, like, bumpy, glassy thing on the outside, okay? Crushed Diamond is coming back. This is, by the way, Crushed Diamond is 10% off right now, and then it's going to be $50 again next week when the new catalog starts. Go, some of these things are going to be 10% off right now as you're watching this video. Okay, I'm just saying. Uh, rose Glitter Gold is the same kind of crunchiness on the outside. The Acute Copper is a very odd shaped warmer. Very strange. Ooh la la. Um, Chard, I have a video where I unboxed Chard. I'll put it right here real quick. Uh, Perfect Pearl is real pretty. Time to Reflect is really pretty. Again, Time to Reflect has a little bit of a negative space, weird mirror-y thing. Looks completely different when it's off and when it's on. I will try to find pictures and put them here of it both off and on. This video is gonna take me a really long time to edit. Sorry, whatever. Uh, bless This Home. So these are more of the country chic uh, warmers, okay? The, this new 40-watt uh, bulb, Shining Light. Okay, so 40-watt bulbs. We have a lot, not a lot, um, 20 maybe, in between 10 and 20 warmers that take a 40 watt bulb, they're generally very bright. Not my cup of tea. And now we've got this shining light. Now this looks a little bit like a lighthouse, a little, it looks almost Asian kind of maybe, not sure exactly what that little circle is on top. That's okay. If somebody buys it local to me, and then I can unbox it, and then I'll show it to you, okay? Bless This Home is nice. Bless This Home is um, not variegated. It's like aluminum. It's like tin. I can't remember the name of the, the, the of it, but it might have it in here. I'm not sure. Sweet Love is the same. It's like a, aluminum tin on the outside. Um, Country Sunshine is $50. That's, that's really pretty if you're into that kind of decor. Home Sweet Home, $45 is tall, eight inches tall, that Home Sweet Home. 
uh, little church people who are you know active in their spiritual practice they love this warmer it's really pretty uh, live simply both the mini and the large have been around forever they've been in the catalog since I've been a consultant okay uh, country living same thing that not variegated what is the word that I'm trying to think of you're watching this and you're like oh, you're screaming it at me um, wildlife mini I don't know if the wildlife large is in this catalog or not but we used to have it was December 2017 that we had the large wildlife warmer it was huge it looked like a bowl and then the the scent that went along with it that month was Scarlet Woods and that's still in my Scentsy Club because I love that wax so much wherever I'm with you this $35 element warmer sells like hotcakes now that I've said that what does wherever I'm with you mean? I don't really get it. Wherever I'm with you. Where, where is the comma? I don't, th th there needs to be a comma in that phrase. Anyway, that's it for the warmers in this section. So now we're talking about Scentsy Bars. I actually have a whole video of me smelling the fragrances. So I'm not gonna go through that in this video. I mean, I'm already 28 minutes in, whatever. Um, I will link me talking about all the new fragrances up here, over here, someplace like that. Um, but yes, there's 10 new fragrances and I liked a lot of them. Like five or six of them were like showstoppers for me. And then we've got the holiday section. And then we move on to page 26. We're in the spice section. Look at this whole page. <laughs> of autumn and winter spice fragrances oh my god now some of them are great some of them i can't warm in my house homestead holiday is fantastic amazing maple apple bourbon don't bring that into my house i don't even carry that in my stock i don't even no can't do it pollutes everything that it's next to even if you don't open up a clamshell so right then and there like two of those things I, one I love and one I absolutely hate. Let's keep going down. Cider Mill, absolutely love that fragrance. Fantastic. It's been in the catalog. It's been in the fall winter catalog since I've been a Scentsy consultant. And then right below that Cinnamon Bear, you will never see me warm Cinnamon Bear because it's Red Hots. Mm -mm. Next page, page 27. Bakery. This is a lot. Bakery is a lot. We have a lot more bakery in the fall winter than we do in the spring summer. Just like with spice, we have a lot more in the fall, winter than in the spring, summer. And then in the spring, summer, we have more of the uh, florals and the uh, like fruit, berries and stuff like that. Anyway, onto page 28. These are all fresh. Now, fresh doesn't necessarily mean soap. Fresh could mean perfect peppermint, which is fall and winter, but yet it's fresh, right? Uh, clean breeze does smell like soap. But eucalyptus wreath does not smell like soap so take a look at this don't if you don't like soapy scents if you like if you prefer a body wash that's unscented or something like that don't discount this page you might really like this page okay um and just uh, as a hint polar bear hug is replacing eskimo kiss because since the inception of eskimo kiss eskimo has been deemed a word that is not um friendly don't ask me why and I'm not questioning it and I'm not saying that it's unnecessary I am not Inuit so I don't know and I am I'll, I'll be the first to admit that I did very poorly in social studies in high school we that's what we called in different parts of the country they call it social studies or government or global history or whatever we called it social studies in new york okay and i was very i i crammed every test i studied five minutes before the test i got my 85 percent on the test and then i forgot it right away so that's the way i got through school now if you ask me about anatomy yes i could talk to you about the 206 bones in the body and i know every single one and i know how to spell them but when it comes to geography and no, I'm bad at it. Sorry. Woods. This whole page is woods, but it's not really that many. So they also put some cute little pictures on the bottom. Hello. Hashtag Scentsy Snapshot. Okay. Um, my favorites on this page are probably, I think I'm going to love uh, Cashmere and Corduroy the most. Um, and there they put mystery man in the woods category. That's awesome. Redberry and spruce came back from the holiday collection last year. So, okay. On to page 30. 
and we are almost halfway through the catalog. It's going to move a little faster now. Sorry. Um, fruity, whole page of fruity, but fruity doesn't necessarily mean drippingly sweet, right? Very Merry Cranberry is not drippingly sweet. Very Merry Cranberry has cedar in it. It's fantastic. Scarlet Sunflower. I loved that fragrance. I haven't warmed it yet. I just smelled it cold in the clamshell. Next page is Citrus, which they separate away from Fruity because it's not berry and it's not apple. Okay. And then Floral. Look, we've only got one. <laughs> but that's okay. I have a lot of wax and I get my Scentsy Club. So I'm a floral girl. So, and here's a nice picture of all the 10 new wax bars. We're at 32 minutes. We've got to start going faster. And this will be, this will go quick because this is the Disney stuff in the same Maffy Cup as it. Okay. Right? So we've got the Mickey and Mickey, Mickey and Mickey. We've got Mickey and Minnie warmers, $50 each. Um, just so you know, the with the Disney stuff, if you're a Scentsy consultant, you probably know this already. We don't make the same commission on the Disney stuff that we do on the other stuff because the licensing fees are crazy for Scentsy. So um, the warmers are a little bit more expensive. The wax bars are a little bit more expensive so that the consultant doesn't like lose out. That kind of thing. Okay. And so we've got the waxes. And then this is brand new on page 33. We've got licensed wall fan diffusers okay so while they're not 100 percent totally brand new to the concept of sensi they are brand new to the catalog because we had the princess wall fan diffuser and then we had the spider-man wall fan diffuser and now we've got mickey and minnie okay they're 35 dollars. normally they're 30 so it's five dollars more because it's the licensed products and we've got licensed pods we also have new buddies uh they redesigned the uh, mickey and minnie buddies and on to page 34, we've got Pooh, Tigger, and Eeyore, and we've got the Honeypot Warmer, honey spelled H-U-N-N-Y. Every Scentsy consultant who has to like look up a price or something for the Honeypot Warmer, they always start to type H-O-N-E-Y, and no, <laughs> it's H-U-N-N-Y. Um, and then you've got the 100 Acre Wood fragrance there, and like I said, on page 35, you've got the Princess Wall Fan Diffuser, but now it's Wall Fan Diffusers. There's two, now they've got the light blue one and the purple one, and they've got the Spider-Man Wall Fan Diffuser and the Marvel um, Warmer, which is very cool. It's very masculine. It's very, if you're into those, the, the design goes all the way around the warmer and glows nicely. It's not too jarring. It's not too in your face glowing. Okay, so next page is we're talking about Scentsy Friends which is basically like a Scentsy Buddy, but then it's also kind of like a doll instead because they're fashioned after human beings. So we've got uh, Jaya, Scentsy Friend, with a little Jenna the Giraffe sitting in her pocket. How cute is that? And then Jenna the Giraffe came back. I will show you a cute little thing I made of the original Jenna the Giraffe, which came out two years ago, and I unboxed it. Totally adorable. And then we've got new Buddy Clips. We've got uh, Tara the Triceratops. How cute is that? Are you kidding me? Um, Sierra the Stegosaurus, we've got dinosaurs. Hamish the Highland Cow with vanilla bean buttercream. A Highland Cow as a buddy clip. So kids can put these on their backpack, adults can put them as on their purse. You can use them as luggage tags. You can throw them in the bottom of your purse so that your purse doesn't smell like, you know, ugh. Um, you could do a lot, of, a lot with the buddy clips. You could, if you wanted to, you can call me up and we can arrange a fundraiser so that the commission goes towards whatever, you know, mission you want that commission to go to, and we can sell buddy clips. It doesn't have to be in person. It could be online, it could be at a school, a preschool, an elementary school, where kids could say, I want this one and I want this one, and then I give whatever the, the charity is, the commission. Call me, all right? We'll, we'll make it happen. Here we go, page 38, air purifier, Sensi air purifier. It is 250 fucking dollars. But if you go on Amazon, you will see that this exact air fryer, air fryer, air purifier is $250. But with this one, you can put the pods in it. Oh. <laughs> I'm getting this and I'm putting it right next to my litter box. Not my litter box, my cat's litter box. You spend a lot of time at home. On average, most people spend 90% of their time indoors where pollutant levels can be surprisingly higher than they are outside there's likely more in our air than we even want to think about. The solution is pure and simple. 
The Sensi Air Purifier quietly cleans the air around you using a HEPA H13 filter to capture 99.95% of airborne particles like dust, pollen, mold, and bacteria while also dispersing signature Sensi fragrance for a totally fresh approach. Because the only thing better than clean is clean and beautifully scented. I'm hoping that it doesn't clog it up too much because the filters are $35, I think. And then we've got all these pods. We've got 35 different fragrances and pods. 35. We started out with like seven. I think a five, something like that. Crazy. So anyway, I am going to be getting the air purifier. I'm going to be doing a full review of it on my channel, whatever. Here's the wall fan diffusers. Some of them have a light, some of them don't. The ones that have a light are $30. The ones that don't have a light are $25, okay? They have three different um, designs for the one without a light, and then they have the one that's swirly with the light, okay? You cannot shut off the light without shutting off the whole kit and caboodle. So, if you like the light, make sure that you want fragrance at the same time. That's all I'll say about that. This takes pods. You don't put wax in here. This takes pods. The pods are a twin pack for 10 bucks. And again, we have 35 different flavors. Page 41, we talk about the different uh, mini fan diffusers that we have. We started off with one. No, we started off with three. We had white and pink and gray. And now we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven different colors. You plug it into your, this is what you do, in your car. You plug it into the USB in your car. And back in the days of COVID, is it over? I don't know. You take your mask off when you get out of the grocery store and you throw the mask on the wall fan diffuser and it freshens up your mask. Or you sit it next to your desk, you plug it into the computer and it's just a fan that runs. There's no on off switch. There's no battery to charge, nothing. You throw a pod on there. I'll show, I'll show you a little video over here. It's the most awesome thing ever. Or you can make an, an additional level of investment and you can get a Sensi Go. The Sensi Go is awesome. The Sensi Go fits in the cup holder of your car. And the Sensi Go can go into your purse. It can go with you to the doctor's office. It can go with you to the gym. You're on the treadmill or the elliptical or something and you have it in the cup holder of the, of the machine that you're working on. And your area, your little atmosphere is gonna smell like Luna or coconut lemongrass or whatever. Yeah, okay. So I love my Scentsy Go. Now let's move on to essential oils. Oh my God, 38 minutes. Uh, this is the new um, Jeweled Deluxe Diffuser. This doesn't have any more decoration than this. Oh, it's jeweled because you see, do you see the, the there's, um, it's a little bit bumpy on top. Okay. I see it, I see it, okay. So this is $65, this has a warranty, okay? Not a lot of companies do a, a, have essential oil diffusers available for purchase that have a warranty. Let me just say that. It's got eight different light modes. You can either have the light on, the light off, you can have the light cycle through different colors, all if you're using the diffuser or not, which is great. So you can have the, just the diffuser on with no light, you can have the, just the light on with no diffuser, Yay. Then there's the premium, okay? Which is just the guts, which I don't even think is that ugly. And then you fit, you see, if you see on page 43, you fit this whole big, sh beautiful shade on top. And as a matter of fact, you see that shade right there? That's the one that I have in my living room right now. The Awaken pr Premium Diffuser. So I had bought the, um, the, the base, the guts of it. And then I slowly bought different diffuser shades to go over it. So then you go on to the next page and you see the Enrich shade, which looks like daisies. It's gorgeous, okay? It's gorgeous. And then on page 45, you'll see all these other diffuser shades that we have. I also, see there's the Awaken right there at the top in the middle. And then I also have Enchant. I also have Reflect. And then I also have Stargaze. The Stargaze is stunning. Every time somebody sees it, they're just like, <gasps> literally. It takes their breath away, okay? So if you think about it, 140 bucks, 150 bucks for a diffuser, it's like, what? That's so expensive. I've had mine going since 2007, 16, 16. I use them all the time. They never hiccuped, they never died, they never broke, nothing. Since 2016, that's five years, okay? On to page 46, we've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, We've got a lot of different essential oils and perfume blends. We've got approximately 25 to 30 different 
um, essential oils and perfume oils. There is a difference between the two. We're not going to get into it this in this video because this is just a catalog walkthrough. Go ahead and read through these uh, fragrances if you like. I am going to be con um, including a digital link to this catalog in the description of this video. If you want to take a look at it, go ahead and do that. Okay. Uh, we're talking about hand cream. We're talking about a moisture medley. This we're, we're going on to body care. Okay. I love the hand cream. I keep one in my car at all times, but I really prefer the body cream. And I go through gallons and gallons of the body cream. Okay. I use the gallon, the galley. I use the body cream every time I take a shower and, um, they are now have the body wash and stuff, the, uh, hygiene stuff in jeweled pomegranate and Cloudberry Dreams. So those are two new fragrances. I'm really looking forward to the Jeweled Pomegranate and the body cream. Oh my God, it's gonna be awesome. Okay, on to page uh, 50, and we are talking about laundry. We have a newly designed laundry label. Um, now it has a little bit of flair to it. Gives you a little hint about the fragrance that's inside. This way you're not trying to look at the little words of what it is. You're going to see like little pictures of what the fragrance notes are. We do have a full line of laundry products. We've got laundry liquid. Uh, we've got washer whiffs. We've got dryer discs. And we've got scent soft. And we've got different sizes of those things also. We now have laundry in Cloudberry Dreams. And then we also have scent soft. Sorry, Scentsy Fresh in Cloudberry Dreams and Palm Beach Breeze. That's the stuff that you spray on fabrics, like the breeze. You spray it on the carpet, you spray it on your sheets, on your curtains, on your dirty clothes, if they're not so clean, obviously. Uh, and we also have Scentsy Fresh in Windowsill Breeze, which is really nice. Okay, so if you, if you notice right there, Scentsy Fresh and Odor Out, we don't have it in laundry, we don't have it in cleaning products. Scentsy Fresh and Odor Out is the thing that I recommend to people who smoke. It covers up smoke, whatever it is that you smoke. Uh, okay, we are on to page 52. We're talking about Counter Clean. I have whole videos on this. Counter Clean, All Purpose Cleaner Concentrate, Bathroom Cleaner, Dish Soap. We have now Cloudberry Dreams in all of those things. Cloudberry Dreams is very popular these days. Cleaning products, we gotta move along, we gotta move along. And we've got uh, Best Bud Suds, which I use. Not me. Well, I have. Whatever. We've got Freshen Up Pop, which I use on my dog. And we've got No Not Spot. I don't need the No Not Spot because my dog has short hair. Okay. Fragrance Flowers. We've got a new fragrance flower in Appleberry. So, sorry. Winterberry Apple Tea. And then we have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12 others. So we have 13 in total. Okay. They come with either... Uh, the Buttercup Belle or the Darling Dahlia, okay? So, so it's two different um, patterns of flower. We also have car bar clips, scent, uh, car bars, scent circles, scent packs, travel tin, and room spray, okay? And then all of these, if you buy three, you get a dollar off. If you buy five, you get the sixth for free because they're consumable, okay? And so 58 and 59 is all about having parties, Okay, and then uh, you can see what you can earn if you just, we're not, you're not talking about joining. We don't want you here if you don't want to be here. But if you want free stuff, let me set you up a party link. Don't be afraid of the word party. It's just a, it's just a link. I'm just setting up a link. That's all. But if you feel like you like what I'm talking about, you might want to think about being a Sensi Consultant. And uh, listen, I, on June 4th of 2015, Sorry, 2014. I uh, bought a kit. Never used Scentsy in my life. Bought a kit because I just wanted to smell all the fragrances. I wanted one of each. And so that's what I got. And now here I am. Uh, was it seven years later? Seven years later. Whatever. Okay. Here I am. Um, this is the compensation plan. So if you think about, um, you know, I actually make money. I don't know. I kind of make money. Whatever. Page 62 is all of the fragrances. And this is a chart with all the fragrances and all the things that the fragrances come in, right? Uh, 63 is kind of the same thing. And then we've got the bundle and save section, which I just said is buy three, get a dollar off, blah, blah, blah. And then we've got all of these. It's basically just a summary and then that's it. I hope you enjoyed this little catalog walk. 
It's gonna take me a really long time to edit, 46 minutes. Oh my God. Um, if you have any questions about anything, let me know. Love you. Do me a favor. Give this video a thumbs down. That's my new thing. Um, if you if you really want to support me, you will give this video a thumbs down. And don't be afraid to give it a thumbs down. Uh, first of all, I don't know who gives a thumbs down and who doesn't. Secondly, I'm telling you to do it. Just do it. Go to MetallicMom.com. Bye.